NVIDIA's RTX 4060 has been a popular choice for gamers seeking high performance at a relatively affordable price point. However, with the upcoming launch of the RTX 5060, consumers are expecting a higher configuration and mentionable updates. Also, many are wondering if it's worth making the jump to the next generation or sticking with what they have. In this video, we'll help you decide if upgrading to the RTX 5060 is the right move for you or if the RTX 4060 still holds its ground in today's market. Let's dive in! In the spec segment firstly, let's talk architecture. The RTX 4060 is built on NVIDIA's Ada Lovelace architecture with 3072 CUDA cores. On the other hand, the RTX 5060 steps it up with the new Blackwell 2.0 architecture and a rumored 4608 CUDA cores. That's surely a great leap in parallel processing power, meaning better performance for tasks like gaming, rendering, and AI-driven workloads. Clock speeds are another area where the RTX 5060 shines. The RTX 4060 operates with a base clock of 1830 MHz and a boost clock of up to 2460 MHz. But the RTX 5060, it's expected to push even higher. 2235 MHz base and 2520 MHz boost. Big edge for the applications where every MHz counts. Now, let's talk about memories. Both GPUs are equipped with 8GB of memory. However, the RTX 4060 utilizes GDDR6, while the RTX 5060 is expected to feature the faster GDDR7 memory. Despite both having a 128-bit memory bus, the RTX 5060's GDDR7 memory is anticipated to operate at 28 gigabytes per second, resulting in a theoretical memory bandwidth of 448 gigabytes per second, compared to the RTX 4060's 272 gigabytes per second. This increase in memory bandwidth could enhance the RTX 5060's performance in higher resolution gaming scenarios. That's a game changer for memory intensive tasks and 4K gaming. The RTX 4060 has 24 3rd gen RT cores and 96 4th gen Tensor cores for features like real time ray tracing and DLSS 3.0. But the RTX 5060 is rumored to up the ante with 36 4th gen RT cores and 144 5th gen Tensor cores, potentially introducing DLSS 4.0. That means sharper visuals and smoother gameplay with AI enhancements. Finally, let's discuss power. The RTX 4060 is a power-efficient GPU with a TDP of just 115 watt, perfect for compact builds. Early reports suggest the RTX 5060 might have a higher TDP around 170 watt due to its performance upgrades. However, some rumors hint it could stick to 115 watt thanks to improved efficiency in the Blackwell architecture. Either way, efficiency is looking strong for 5060. When comparing the two GPUs in gaming scenarios, the RTX 5060 shows a marked improvement in frame rates across modern titles. Benchmark tests reveal that the RTX 5060 consistently delivers 15-25% higher performance in 1080p gaming, with a smaller margin in 1440p gaming due to CPU bottlenecks. This is largely due to its improved shader execution efficiency and better ray tracing performance. Games like Cyberpunk 2077 and The Witcher 3 highlight these differences, with the RTX 5060 handling ray-traced environments more smoothly and the FPS are mentionable. The RTX 4060, however, remains a capable performer, especially for gamers playing at 1080p. Its performance is still adequate for most modern titles, albeit without the enhanced frame rates or graphical fidelity the RTX 5060 can achieve. For budget-conscious gamers, it provides a solid entry point into ray tracing and AI-enhanced graphics. Now, let's shift gears to productivity tasks. This is where the RTX 5060 really flexes. In productivity tasks such as video editing, 3D rendering, and AI model training, the RTX 5060's newer architecture provides great advantages. Applications like Blender, Adobe Premiere Pro, and TensorFlow benefit from the faster tensor cores and improved memory bandwidth, reducing rendering and computation times compared to the RTX 4060. For less demanding workflows or software optimized for the Ampere architecture, the RTX 4060 still holds its own. But for creators looking to future-proof their setups, the RTX 5060 is the clear winner. 
Coming to the price. As of its launch, the RTX 4060 is priced at around 299 USD for the Founders Edition model. Third-party variants from various manufacturers might come at a slightly higher cost, depending on cooling solutions and overclocking capabilities. The RTX 4060 is aimed at the mid-range gaming segment, offering solid 1080p and 1440p performance. Given that the 4060 sits in the entry-level segment of the RTX 40 series, its pricing makes it an attractive option for gamers seeking good performance at a reasonable price. While the RTX 5060's release date and pricing are speculative, it is reasonable to assume that the price will be higher than that of the RTX 4060, given the expected advancements in technology and performance. Analysts suggest that the RTX 5060 could be priced in the range of $349 to $399 USD, targeting gamers who seek a balance between performance and affordability. However, this is purely speculative, and the final price could vary depending on the actual specifications and market trends at the time of its release. The RTX 4060 offers good value for money in terms of price-to-performance ratio. For $299 USD, you're getting a GPU that performs well in most modern games at 1080p and 1440p, and supports advanced technologies such as DLSS and ray tracing. Additionally, the power efficiency of the RTX 4060 ensures that users can build more compact systems without sacrificing performance. While it is difficult to make a direct comparison without knowing exact pricing and performance benchmarks, the RTX 5060 will likely represent a better long-term investment for gamers who plan to game at higher resolutions or want to future-proof their systems. Moreover, with improvements in ray tracing and AI technology, it could offer a better overall experience, especially with new game titles and future software optimizations. To summarize, if you're aiming for better future-proofing or you're planning on playing the latest AAA titles with higher settings, the RTX 5060 could be a worthwhile upgrade. However, for those with a tight budget or who are content with the performance of the RTX 4060, waiting for price drops or further performance benchmarks before upgrading might be a more prudent choice. Ultimately, whether the RTX 5060 is worth upgrading depends on the performance gap, the value for money in your region, and how much you're looking to push your gaming or creative workloads.